Hey guys, this is the first opportunity I've had. Uh, everybody requested the Sandman Intel, so I'm going to bring you that. And maybe I'll do the summary all together, but I'm going to do the Sandman first, give him preference. I did discuss it last night on my live. If you didn't see that, you might want to go see that. And if you missed the live stream this morning where I did the raffle, you might want to check that out just in case you missed uh earning a raffle item. I raffled off a lot of things. My husband helped me, so it was really fun. So uh, the links to that, you can find on my channel under live links. You'll see the, both of those links. Um, <clears throat> and just keep me in prayer because I am still run down from my trip, losing all those hours coming back, 24 hours of travel on the way back from Hawaii. Uh, again, it was all expenses paid. Um, there's a lot of people out there that like to tear everybody down. So I'm just doing my best to help everybody. Um, so this is what he couldn't talk about, the gold. The production of gold in Iraq could be more than oil eventually, given where it's from. Uh, biblically, there's biblical references to that, uh, where the gold is kept down the Euphrates River, etc. So they're very valuable in terms of their potential gold production as well, in addition to their oil. So that's pretty cool. And what Sandman said about that specific video, it said, this is what I could not tell you, mates. Sandman 1 said, once it came out, O could share with you. We have known this fact, but could not say anything. Now it's out, and you will be amazed by this information. It is being mined at this present time over here. Good evening, mate. Sandman's team is, um, hold on. Oh, ho, ho. Sandman's team is, I'm losing it. Um, is with the LIDAR system. It is technology we use to find oil and shows all of the underground structures and formations uh, for about 60 meters deep. That's the update this evening. That's Sandman 2. Then he sent the latest articles this morning that were new this morning. So I'm going to read some of those. It says, oil is set for a second week of gains. Oil minister announces increasing Oil Minister announces increasing the production capacity of the Seba gas field. Guys, so it continues, the progress continues in Iraq. So I hope you will join us in praying this thing in. I pray that this revalues for not only the Iraqi citizens, but for all of us that have been holding this currency, some of us for years, some of us for more than 10 years, like myself. Guys, I'm sorry, I just got finished doing some uh, work around the house. Um, and it says, let's see. For his part, the director general of the Basra Oil Company, Basim Abdul Karim, explained that the central treatment station for the Seba gas field consists of two banks with a capacity of 55 cubic meters for each bank with a production rate of 100 cubic meters. Ten wells have been drilled in the field, and we aim to increase their number, reaching their valuable production capacities, noting that the Seba gas field is one of the gas fields that was referred within the third licensing round. So... That's pretty cool, guys. There's a lot going on in Iraq that make it very profitable, um, not only now, but in the future. Um, let's see. And then this was something I highlighted last night, a special meeting behind closed doors. Uh, again, uh, Sandman and his team are on the border, still doing their jobs, keeping it secure with the coalition. Um, and so he sent this article, the UN Security Council to discuss Iraq budget security and human rights is on the agenda. Guys, there's all sorts of meetings going on. This could be released at any time. So keep your prayers up there. Positive prayers only is what works. It says, the report concluded by suggesting that Security Council members are likely to commend the efforts of the Iraqi government during its first year in power and welcome the relative political stability it has maintained, as well as the progress it has made in developing its governmental programs, including approving the budget and setting a date for local elections. However, the report also noted that some Security Council members may express concerns about the negative impact of recently adopted regulations on human rights. Some may also condemn violations of Iraq's sovereignty and the safety of its territory in the context of the ongoing Turkish airstrikes against the Kurdish region. So guys, there's plus and minuses to everything in this region. There always is, but that is the latest from Sandman. And I am just excited for all of us guys that are holding this currency, because again, I've got a prophetic gift from God and God has told me over and over again that this is done and to help prepare you for it so you can get your money and get yourself safe for whatever happens next. Okay, so if you'd like information on that, I'll put my email down below. You can contact me about doing some ninjas. I have a 
a special package right now, all three sessions, pre Ninja, post Ninja, and the, um, the exchange day strategy, uh, come at a special price, 222. So that's cash app Venmo PayPal is 227 for an hour and for all strategies to help you prepare completely. So if you want to take advantage of those, my email's down below. I'm scheduling out for next week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. And I'm going to try to start taking the weekends off because I am a little run down. I need to take care of myself. So limited time this weekend for those appointments. But I love you all with the love of Jesus Christ. I hope you'll join me on the channel, especially if you're Christian and praying this in. Positive prayers are the only thing that works. And I'm just glad you're here. Please subscribe, tap the bell, and please share so we can grow the family of like-minded believers and we can stay together. Guys, we don't all believe in the same things, but the closer we are, the closer we come to this, the more we need to pray this in. Amen. God bless. Have a great day. Bye.